In case you didn't know, today is National Drink Beer Day. You have plenty of options if you choose to celebrate. We have a lot of breweries in central Indiana offering great beers on tap. One of those breweries, awesome place, is the Metazoa Brewing Company in downtown Indy, where you can bring a four-legged friend along with you. That's cool. Joining me now live is Vice President of Metazoa, Lauren Frederick. Lauren, good morning to you. Good morning. Hey, for those who didn't know, how'd you guys get started? So Metazoa was founded um, in, in April of 2016 um, with kind of this mission to not only make great beer, but also give 5% of all profits um, to various animal and wildlife charities. So kind of a, a two-part goal. All right, and you mentioned great beer. What kind of beers do you have on tap? So I just did a little tally, and as of right now, we have 25 different beer offerings. Um, so a very wide variety, something for everybody's taste, and they're all made right there um, in the downtown Indianapolis tap room. Um, so a good mix, but I would say our best seller is our Hoppopotamus IPA, kind of a really well-balanced American IPA. that um, was just named one of the top 25 IPAs in the country by uh, Craft Beer and Brewing Magazine. So um, that's definitely our best seller, but then... You know, we try to do some experimental stuff. We have a Brewer's Reserve series um, that allows our brewers to each kind of play a little bit with different recipes. So try to keep a, a wide variety. And quite the honor as well. Now, we saw some pictures. I'm not sure if you were able to see them at the same time with people and their pets being brought in at the same time. Now, aside from that, which is a great perk for an establishment, what other things are you doing basically to, to help you and the animals at the same time? Yeah, so um, in addition to just being pet friendly and, and really focused on pets, we do, um, we have 10 different um, partners that we work with as part of our charity program. Um, so we do a variety of different uh, rescue events with, you know, places like the Indy Humane Society. Um, we also do give back nights and kind of features on some of our more nuanced partners, um, such as Friends of Ferdinand, um, which is a, a, a sanctuary for retired racehorses. Um, Black Pine Animal Sanctuary, Exotic Feline Rescue Center, and we kind of do different events in the tap room to really feature those charities and talk about all the great work they're doing. Now, we saw a lot of dogs there in the tap room from the pictures. Uh, any other animals that uh, have ever come your way? Oh, yeah, Scott. We've had cats. We've had rabbits. Um, I've seen a couple of lizards. Um, in partnership with Friends of Ferdinand, we actually had miniature horses there one time. Um, so it's kind of a lions and tigers and bears, oh my, situation there <laughs> some days. I love the mini horses. Those are so cute. They're they are so really spunky cute. as well. Any problems ever? No. No, we've been very lucky. Um, I think it's a little bit self-policing as far as the dog. You know, no one wants to be the person with the bad dog in the tap room. So. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. Hey, Lauren, thanks for being here. We do appreciate it. Awesome. Thanks for having me. Not a problem.